Oh, what's up guys? I'm a shining star. How are you doing? Guess who's back? Me. I'm, I, it's me. I'm the one that's back. Obviously. Today's video is probably going to be a popular one. It's a very highly requested thing. A lot of guys are looking for this right here. And this is going to be about my nose itches. Gosh dang. This is going to be about my three favorite beard products that are cologne scented. Now for me, I'm not a super avid cologne user, but it is cool when you're going out for a night on the town or if you're going out on a date with your wife or something like that and allergies, Jesus Christ. Um, and you want to smell, you want your beard to smell good. You know, look at the bling bling. I'll tree y'all better put some respect on my name. Sorry, I got distracted there for a minute. Anyways, let's get into it. I'm gonna talk to you about the number one thing right now that I use that is cologne scented. The number one thing that I am growing through this product like crazy. That's gonna be the black light beard butter from Fresh Beards. I get a lot of products and I have to like test stuff out a lot. But when I'm not, I'm almost always using this right here. This stuff kicks ass, the smell is great, the consistency is really, really, really on point. Now Beard butter story, aside from this, beard butter, I didn't understand it at first. I did not understand it. You can watch my old videos and be like, when I'm talking about like how beard butter, it doesn't make sense to me. And I had tried a few and they just didn't feel good to me. Like, but I tried this beard butter and this consistency is like perfect. Like a lot of, like a lot of beard butters that I've tried are like sticky or like they just feel really, really overly thick, I guess, in the beard. Whereas this Fresh Beard stuff, and every Fresh Beards product I've tried is the same. It's, it's all the same consistency as far as butter-wise. But um, this is like the perfect consistency butter-wise for me, in my opinion. I love this consistency. It's nice and smooth. You don't need a whole bunch to get your beard covered and it works amazing. I really like this stuff. I'm gonna link it down below. Now I do have a, I'm pretty, yeah, I have a discount code for this and then I have a discount code for one of the others on here. One of them I don't, um, but I'll link this down below. I think you have to follow the direct link to get to the discount code. If not, then I'll pop the discount code right here. So yeah, just go down to the description. I'll also pin it as the top comment. If you don't know how to find the description, just go down to the comment section. It'll be pinned as the top comment and that'll take you to a landing page where you get, um, uh, discount like automatically applied or something like that. But yeah, nothing but good experiences with this company and their products. You got to check it out guys. Anyways, on to the next. And that is going to be the original lumberjack beard grease. And now they call it beard, they call it beard grease, but it's, it's just a beard balm is what it is. But this product stands out above all other beard balms to me. Number one, it has the, this is their black tie scent right here. So the black tie is it's the cologne scent of the bunch basically. And it does, it has like a nice cologne smell. I don't know which specific cologne it is, but it definitely has a cologne smell to it. And this one as well, I do get a discount code for, and I'll pop that right here. So you, if you go to the website, you can use this discount code and get some, some off your purchase. But in the world of beard balms, this product stands out by far to me as the smoothest, creamiest beard balm I've ever used. Something they're doing with their process of making this is just, leaps and bounds beyond any other beard balm I've ever tried. Now there could come a day where somebody has equaled this creaminess and smoothness, but as of yet, I have not yet experienced it. This is, here, let me get a, let me get a close up on the camera so you can see what I'm talking about. Okay, let's not waste that. Let's put it in the beard. Wow, it's been forever since I've had beard balm in my beard actually. So yeah, that cologne smell is awesome guys. And I don't know if this like captures the essence of how smooth and creamy this balm is on camera when I'm doing that. But if you've experienced this stuff right here, it is, it's, it's, it's quite the experience. It's just by far the most high quality feeling beard balm that has ever been made to me. Um, that I, well, that I've ever tried. Quality matters too, I would check this out. I'll put the link below. You'll get like a 15 or 20% discount or something like that, I think. And then number three, of course, everybody knows this one and this is gonna be the Holy Grail. No surprise here. Now the Holy Grail is not, it's not like a cologne scent, I guess. It's kind of a different, it's just oud. It's just oud agar wood. Um, and there are companies doing this. And so Kingsman was just the first like big company doing this, that they were the ones really putting their name out there and doing the oud, um, the oud oil. And the thing with oud oil is it's very, very rare. It's really expensive <laughs> and the smell is phenomenal. Here's the most accurate way I can describe Holy Grail um, or the uh, Garwood scent. And, and this is only if you've ever been to a Catholic church. So if you've ever been to a Catholic church, I grew up Catholic and the priest comes down and they're doing that. Um, uh, it's not the Palm, it's not Palm Sunday. Maybe it is Palm Sunday. I forget. Um, but they'll put that, the smoke in the chalice, like a wood and it, and they'll swing this chalice going down the aisle and that smell comes. That is, um, a Garwood. And a lot of times, um, some 
Catholic churches will use it just as a general scent throughout the church. So if you've ever walked into a Catholic church and there's a, a weird smell, like not weird smell, but a very distinct smell, that's what this is right here. So basically you smell like a damn Catholic church. <laughs> no, it's, it's a really, really good smell, guys. Um, if you've never tried it out, try it out. It's phenomenal. I don't have a discount code for this one. Once in a while I get a discount code, but it's such a popular item that the owner really doesn't have to do like uh, giveaways or discount codes. People are just gonna buy it because of the name and what it is, and it's really good stuff. And again, everything will be linked down below. Um, these, these two I do have the discount code for. The Holy Grail I do not. So to summarize, if you're wanting beard butter, this is probably the best beard butter I've used, and it has a cologne scent, beard balm. This is hands down the best beard balm I've ever tried as far as quality wise, and it has the cologne scent as well. And then everybody knows the Holy Grail name. Everybody knows, it's just a, it's just a staple name. I just noticed we got the old 5% the old tattoo with the Rich Piana shirt. I'm matching today, I'm matching my tattoo today. I feel proud. Also, you can follow me on Instagram, official beard tube, if you wanna just see my daily stories in life. And I, once in a while, I post to the actual account. I post like once every week, <laughs> if that. But the stories, I'm there, I just, it's like a daily blog, if you wanna watch my daily life. But yeah, guys, thanks for watching. Have a great day. Stay bearded. Bye.